Welcome to Lovely English Stories. Thank you for stopping by. We hope you enjoy this story for upper beginner English learners. English Story A2 The English Countryside The English countryside is beautiful. There are lots of farms, national parks, fields and woods. The great thing about England is that the countryside changes a lot with the seasons. In spring, the flowers bloom and the birds start to sing again. In the summer, the sun shines and we can enjoy the warmer weather. In autumn, the leaves on the trees change colour and there's a special smell in the air. When winter arrives, we can enjoy the colder weather, the wind and the snow. The seasons make nature even more magical. Alison loves to walk in the English countryside. It doesn't matter what time of year it is. Alison will always go for a walk. If it is cold, she will just wear another jacket and a hat. If the weather is hot, she will wear shorts and lots of sun cream. At the weekend, she will often go for walks with her friends and family. She has favourite places that she likes to explore. Sometimes she will walk around country villages. Sometimes she will walk around some woodland or around a lake. There are lots of lakes where Alison lives. When she goes to the lakes, she usually takes sandwiches and a flask of tea. She likes to sit and eat and watch nature. She likes to close her eyes and listen to the ducks and the leaves on the trees moving in the wind. Sometimes she gives the ducks some bread. They all swim over to eat some. At her local lake, she has seen many beautiful ducks and birds. Once she saw a kingfisher. It moved very quickly but she saw its orange and blue feathers. Alison always feels relaxed and happy when she has been for a walk. She usually walks between five and ten miles. Sometimes Alison goes walking with a local walking group. They are a friendly group of people who meet once a month. They walk about 10 miles and at the end of the walk, they go to the pub. Alison has met some very nice people at the walking group. It is nice to walk with other people and enjoy the countryside together. Alison always likes to be very prepared for her walks. She takes her backpack and lots of snacks. She has walking boots and waterproof clothes. You always have to be ready for rain in England. 
Alison would like to go to the Lake District on a walking holiday. The Lake District is an area of natural beauty in the north of England. There are lots of lovely walks there. She's saving up so she can visit and stay in a nice hotel. She also likes to walk in the Peak District. There are lots of beautiful paths, hills and views to explore. When she goes for walks, she has to drive there. Alison would like to live in the countryside one day. She would like to have a little stone cottage with a big garden. She loves flowers and would plant a rose garden and lots of trees so the birds have somewhere to sit and build nests. One of Alison's favourite things about walking is to be able to have a big dinner at the end of it. In the summer, she will make a roast dinner and sit in the garden to eat it. In her garden, she has lots of wildlife. She has two hedgehogs who live in her garden and she has lots of birds and cats who like to visit her. She always leaves bread and seeds for the birds. She loves to sit and listen to them while she reads. A lot of people do not like the winter, but Alison does. She can go for walks and see how beautiful the ice looks on the water. She also likes to look at the frost on the grass. She likes to do the same walk at the beginning of each season. She takes photographs. She likes to see how the countryside changes with the seasons. Alison loves the English countryside because it is so different in every county. In Yorkshire, it is hilly. In Lincolnshire, it is very flat. And in Cornwall, it is wild and rugged. There is something for everyone. England and Wales also have the famous national trails. These are paths which you can walk or cycle. They are everywhere. You can choose paths at the seaside or inland. Alison has walked most of the Pennine Way, which starts in Derbyshire and goes all the way to Scotland. The best thing about walking in the English countryside is that it's free. It doesn't cost you a penny. All you need is some good boots, some snacks and maybe an umbrella. Whenever Alison is feeling a little stressed or worried, she knows that after a walk and spending some time in the English countryside, she will feel much better. Fresh air, friendly people and lovely views always make her happy. What is the countryside like in your country? Do you have a favourite place where you like to walk? Tell us in the comments below. We hope you enjoyed this lovely English story. Thank you for stopping by. Don't forget to like, subscribe and share.